All right, guys, and we are back. Um, I went and made us a couple of shovels, and we're going to go ahead and keep working through the night to take down this hill. And uh, we'll probably finish it this evening. And uh, we, I guess we don't have to worry too much about uh, mobs. I do have my bow. I got my sword on the ready. And uh, we get it hassled. We'll just take them down. We're not scared anyway. All right, so let's go ahead and get busy on this mountain. Not mountain, but this hill. All right, let's see where we're at here. I think we're still working our way from the back to the front, so. Okay. And we're not gonna. If we get attacked, we'll fight back, but we're not gonna. I do that. I just jumped in, but he's not paying too much attention to us. Which is good. He doesn't need to. We're not bothering him. But you know these mobs. Hmm. Don't worry guys, we will take care of that. Okay. See now they're starting to notice us over here, so XP, give me your balls. Alright. Yeah, now we can't work our way too too much more. There's a spider over there. You know, different mobs can sense you out of DC. Spiders can really We took a few hits. It's all right. We'll just eat a potato or two. And this is really coming along. We're really going to enjoy being able to flatten this out. I know some of this stuff, you're like, flu, this is boring. We don't want to see you do that. Just pause the recording and do this on your own. We don't want to see this. We want to see fun stuff. You know what? That's how this this is how we do one on legit fun throughs. You know, the whole experience. And um, not to be mean, but again, you know, um, for me, it's fun to be able to record all this stuff and. Do stuff so that you know that you know I'm again doing everything legit, not cheating. My goodness, look at this. And this is this is another reason why we I, you know record this you know on you know th this whole thing because look at this, look at this whole thing here. I don't even know what I'm gonna do about this. You know, as it is, I think I'm probably gonna have to fill it in from the bottom. Because I'm gonna have, but I'm I am gonna have to go down there though. I don't know I don't know if there is an opening somewhere. I think what I'm gonna have to do is I'm just gonna have to jump down there with all my goods and everything. Um, there are some guys down there. Look at that. Mm. I'm, gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to go down there. Let me shovel. I'm a dancer. I'm a dancer.
This guy's got a gold helmet on, so he's got some protection on this. Okay. Okay, I got some torches down here. Go ahead and let's put a little light on the situation. And we'll leave the light down here, see? That's good. Oh, what the heck was that? Okay. So, we're going to continue going down. The whole cave system down here, and uh, we're gonna leave this alone for right now. We're not gonna, not gonna bother with this. We are gonna light it up though. Come on, then, Cletus. What you got? I got bow too. That's right. What's some of this? Wow! Look at this. This is a cave of epicness right here, boy. All right. We're going to have to check that out later on. Yeah. But lighting it up is definitely going to help the, uh, the, the these mobs not to spawn in here. Okay, so this is where we went up. I need to grab my pick. Sun's coming up, so I think we're doing all right. I have to get this stuff from the top. Oh yeah, I'll get this from the top here. And we're just gonna take down this this top layer. The rest of this stuff we can do. Fill it in with dirt. You have to fill it in with dirt anyways. Stone pickaxe. Whatever. Alright. I've got that all squared away. Now, take a stack of dirt and begin to fill it up. And um, we're going to have to be careful because if we um, decide to put like farm and stuff out here, you know we're going to need a water source. And if we dig down, we're going to dig straight down into the hole. But since we do have a, um, kind of a, um, oops, actually ran out of dirt. Once we do kind of have some like this little makeshift uh, stairway to heaven here, I'm gonna just go ahead and put a block there. Or you know what? Um, plant a tree. All right, looking good. Again, I'm not burning it because I need the wood. Because if you saw our raw wood box, it's there's not a lot in there. So I'm not, I'm not going to chop. all oh, let's see an apple. Perfect. That's stuff that you don't get when you burn the trees down. You don't get apples and stuff. This is beautiful. Thanks for sticking around and enjoying the series. Thanks for subscribing, all you. Appreciate you guys taking time out of your busy schedules to check out my noobness. Take this floating tree out of here. Okay. Beautiful. I right, know that tree will die. And we have more of this stuff here. Okay. Gravel. Ooh, 
What is this? This is Furpic. Only thing, the only other thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take some more of this tree down here. And believe it or not, taking these two trees down is really going to open up the space for, um, you know, advancement, expansion. All right. So hopefully, if there are no logs in this. Yeah, I think we're, I think we're clear. Now, if you remember in these episodes, this whole thing was just nothing but trees. Yeah, we started burning this stuff down. Look how much, look how open this is now. This is really good. Look at that, huh? And it still looks pretty natural. Pretty happy with it. Okay, let's put that away there. Put this, put that. And since we're in the area, our chicken has not really been laying the eggs like he should. That's a fresh one, and nothing came out of it. Urgh, chicken, we need to. Eggs, eggs, chicken, eggs. All right, so let's. Oh, we need to eat. A little hungry. And I thought of uh, maybe doing something different with this. I thought of also about building a new house. You know, again, because this game really is endless. So much to do all the time. Looking good. All right. This is real good. So much more room now. We could actually do the same thing with this thing. Because this thing's just kind of in the way and it's annoying. Um, we could actually fill all this in because we definitely got the dirt for it. I mean, there's nothing really down here. We've, you know, lit, you know, put a bunch of light on it, so it's all lit up. Hmm. But this is looking good. I see, you know, grass is growing in. Apples. Picking all, all the saplings and stuff in case we want to plant some more tree. This really is turning out to be something else. Really nice. And the more we clear out of here, you know, the the you know the nicer it'll become. Did you hear that? That can't be from down below. It's gotta be from over here. Yeah, I think we probably should take down these trees back here too. But that's going to be another time. But at any rate, um, you know, feeling pretty good about, you know, how this is turning out. Um, again, we can turn this into a huge farmland. We have, you know, plenty of dirt now in our box. We could even, you know, fill this up to a certain degree. Take the sand out, replace it with, excuse me, with uh, dirt even this over here, and just begin, uh, even just making this, you know, a farm, you know, be, would be pretty good, I think, you know, so even if we were to, I just want to see, you know, I mean, you start taking stuff down, and you just get excited, you're like, yeah, that'll work, yeah, we could do that. Bah. Wow. 
Oh yeah. Got some roses over here too. I seen it. I don't want to go away. Go away. All right. This is looking good. Got some uh, hills over there that we probably could go look at, but. Yeah, I think uh, La Tierra is looking pretty good, and I think that's what we're going to call it. I know we, uh, I talked about it once before in, in an episode about giving this whole area a name, you know, kind of like uh, Bonanza was with, uh, you know, the Ponderosa, you know, that was the name of their, their land. And, you know, Ponderosa, again, it doesn't mean anything in Spanish. It has no English translation. Um, it's just a name. Um, but, but tierra, that's different, you know, tierra in Spanish, that means the earth or the land. So I think that's uh, pretty good. And, uh, we could call it, you know, like mi tierra or like my earth or my land or, you know, something like that. And, uh, or we can just leave it, you know, the land or the earth and, um, uh, That'll be it, you know, because we, we, you know, we don't have to settle on, on this, just this one little area here. We can expand. We can go different places and stuff. I mean, you know, we pretty much got the, the run of the whole place. And so why, you know, limit ourselves to just one little spot over here on the, you know, on the shore here with, with a little house. I mean, that, that's nice to start with, but we might have to go bigger, you know, make a library and stuff like that, even, even though there's really no cows, eventually we'll get cows and we'll be able to make books and, and bookshelves and, you know, um, armor and stuff like that. But, uh, again, thanks for watching. Appreciate uh, the support, the, subs the, uh, the subscriptions, the likes, the comments. Uh, keep them coming. And, um, again, thanks so much for uh, to uh, X No Limits 415 uh, for the inspiration, for being my partner in this. And, uh, again, he has not forgotten. He is just kind of on a hiatus right now dealing with school and other jazz. You know, he's got you know, more important things to do. So he'll be back real soon and uh, we'll once again be playing and stuff. And uh, I hope, I really hope it's real soon and I know you guys too. So um, thanks again. We'll see you in the next episode.